In maintaining a safe and nurturing environment is any school's top priority, but stopping bullying is no easy process. At Rockledge Elementary, they're getting closer by changing the way that kids feel about themselves. Whether you're a kid, I've been bullied, or an adult, it was so hurtful and so mean. Some are judged by the color of their skin. People say I'm not native because I'm white. Others, their stature. She wouldn't let me go on the glider because I was too tall, and she would say mean things about me. These kids know all too well that words can be powerful. It hurts. They make fun of me saying I'm white, and I am, but I'm half native. With help from places like Harbor House and their guidance counselors. Would that make it worse, do you think, or would it make it better? These students are learning ways to not only cope with bullying, take deep breaths, but how to intervene. Go up to a bully and say, this is not nice, you need to stop this. Being an upstander is the focus of today's lesson. No matter if it's words, no matter if it's physical, no matter if it's just simply leaving someone out. All of those ways are ways to hurt people. But when push comes to shove, standing up to the bully isn't always easy to do. Our brains say this is what we need to do, but when there's social pressures on the outside, sometimes it's easier just to, you know, follow the crowd. That's where guidance and practices from counselors like Jennifer Sajinsky come in. There are a lot of different things that I go into the classroom and teach. Just like math, English, or history, school counselors have a curriculum to follow. One of the major benchmarks we do focus on is conflict resolution, um, behavioral emotional management, and also just how to handle bullying. When a student doesn't have a strong foundation emotionally or has heavy stressors in their lives, you don't get any friends. Learning comes second. My role is to make sure that every student in this school knows that there's an adult who loves them, who cares for them, who is supporting them, so that they realize, you know what, people respect me, I matter, I'm here to learn. And the results are priceless. And Jennifer told me that she often receives proud letters from the students about their strides in resolving issues. We'll be right back.